What's up guys and welcome to New Tarot. I am an energy and intuitive reader and I'm here to do the current path for somebody. So let's see who's going to get this reading. Aquarius. What's up Aqua? Thank you so much for being here. This message can resonate with you if you have Aquarius as a sun, moon, rising, or Venus sign. All right, Aquarius. So in this reading, I'm going to see what path you're on, what you did to get to this path, the purpose of this path, and the result. And then we are going to um, pull three cards for guidance or advice, okay? Aquarius spirit. Aquarius. Oh, happy birthday. It's your birthday. Okay. <laughs> All right, Aquarius. What path is Aquarius currently on, Spirit? The Strength card could be dealing with the Leo. Okay, so um, this, the path that you're on is of endurance, is of strength, is things could be happening in your life to see how strong you are right now, see how you can handle things. Are you going to break? Are you going to give in to things? Um, are you going to put your foot down? Are you going to be assertive? Or are you just going to allow people to do what they want here? It's kind of like you showing people the way. You showing people, listen, I I am a strong individual and I can make my own choices. I can do my own things here, okay? Um, what did you do to get here? Six of Swords. I feel like you were mentally um, stuck in a certain mindset, in a certain way of doing things. Um, and I feel like you had to walk away from that mindset here because I just feel like it kept you in a rocky waters type of energy. Like it was never smooth sailing. And I, and I mean, of course, you, you guys do have um, a tendency to overthink. Um, you guys could be also very stubborn and kind of very fixed on a certain idea or a certain thing. Kind of Kind of a little bit like Virgo, but yours is more consistent flowing virgo is like this is what it is it's always going to be like that <laughs> but um i just feel like um you had to mentally move away from a certain mindset in order for you to get to this strength energy this i am powerful because i feel like this mindset this way of thinking whatever this was mentally it was stopping you okay um what's the purpose of this path the emperor of course <laughs> This is Aries energy. You could have that in your chart. This is for you to take control, to have control yourself, not your thoughts, not your mind, but your heart more, mostly. And it's crazy because I'm not really getting that. I don't usually get that from the emperor. Um, the emperor. I, I wanted to say empress uh, from the emperor because the emperor is very much like a leader, authority, very much Aries energy, you know, um, and you don't really get a lot of love <laughs> energy from the emperor. But that's what I'm getting right here. You know, like it's like you have you had to start making choices and take control of your life and not go off by what what susan says what amanda says what evan says it's like no what do i want what do i want and it's not what and it's not what logically uh makes sense either i, I feel like you're also moving away from that too because that's also part of control is you're saying well this makes sense and I, what I realized on my journey, Aquarius, is that a lot of things don't make sense. And also what I realized on my journey is if the more that you try to make something make sense, the more the universe is going to come and show you, no, it don't make sense. Right. And just sometimes it's not supposed to. And, and we have to be able to be like, you know what, sometimes there's more, there's better. There's more. There's more opportunities in other areas and might not be what you want. I'm also kind of getting that, okay? What's the result of this path for Aquarius? Eight of Wands, fast movement. Some of you guys aren't aren't in this energy yet. You kind of have Pisces in your chart because they kind of had the same thing, but yours is more like an internal. They were more out, external. Um, bottom of the deck is the Three of Cups in reverse. Yeah, I feel like this all happened, Aquarius, because you had to remove yourself from certain family members, certain friendships, certain connections, certain groups of people that just don't have the best intentions for you now i'm not saying that they're horrible and then they're mean and they're evil that's not what i'm saying 
I'm just saying that their path, it they don't think about what they do is going to affect you. And you and these people, you're in their circle, so it's going to affect you. Um, and it's not because, like I said, they're bad people. It's just they're more focused on them and themselves and moving forward, you know. And that's not really your energy because you are more worried about the collective as a whole. And these people really aren't. And as much as you want to hang out with these people, as much as you want to be with these people, it's just like the universe, I feel like, is showing you no, Aquarius. I feel like some of you guys could be having issues when it comes to your family or your friendships right now. And if you guys are, the universe wants you to start taking control of that here. They want you to move away from all of this with the eight of wands here. And I feel like once you put your foot down, be assertive, that's when things will start moving for you quick like fast okay all right so let's see what the advice or guidance is here spirit for aquarius ooh 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 aquarius Bottom of the deck is C, turn or slow down, be persistent. Right. Take your time. You have clam, open up, it's okay to be vulnerable. So this is like advice for you. This is what it's coming through as. Um, even when you separate yourself from these energies, you know, putting your foot down, taking control, whatever you're doing, do not close up. And I like this card because I'm, I feel like this is the, also the universe testing you. They're like, we're, they're like, okay, we see Aquarius is, is, is trying to take care of business, you know, like you're doing what you got to do over here. So you, you know, the universe loves to, um, how can I say this? They love to reward us, especially when we do things that benefit us and gets us out of our comfort zone. Whatever we do that is for growth, we always get something in return. And, and it might even be the smallest thing, but it's going, it's something, right? Definitely something that, that you didn't have before. Um, and that's what I feel like is going to happen for you with the, um, be open. Cause whatever this is, it's like, you got something else coming to you and you don't want to be in this closed off energy because of this to accept something else. Okay. You have will your voice matters. Speak your truth. Be honest. Okay. About everything. Um, do not hold back how you feel. Um, cause I feel like that's kind of how you got into this three of cups energy in reverse. It's like maybe these people, these friendships, these families, um, you know, you didn't really speak how you feel. You kind of like went with the flow. Whatever they wanted, you wanted to. But deep down, it affected you in some way because maybe you had to sacrifice something and they didn't. And it's kind of like, speak up. Say no. Say no. I, I, I want to go do this and then I'll come and help you. Or I got to do this. Give me some time and I'll be there. Right? Because that is part of your um, growth here in this lifetime Aquarius as having an Aquarius if you have it as a son but I feel like anywhere that you have it is kind of the same concept where you have to learn that yes you are a humanitarian yes you love to help people and be around your community and your friendships and you love that but you also have to remember that you are the one in control with the strength card right people see how much you you're open to people and how much you care and they'll come in and just take advantage of that without them really knowing that they're doing it some of them do know that they're doing it um but other people don't they're just like oh well Aquarius because you don't you don't really have any boundaries you don't really have a uh and it's not really boundaries it's just like it's just like being being cautious of your needs first before going out and helping others okay and then you have sharks. Be careful. Proceed with caution. Like I said, there's people out here who don't have the best intentions for you. There's people out here who want to keep you stuck, want to keep you in a certain mindset, in a certain place in your life. And again, it's it might not even be malicious. OK, it just could be how they're used to doing things in their life, how they're used to. It's like these people around you haven't really changed their mindset, have kind of been stuck this doing the same thing the same way all their lives. And it's affecting you in a negative way. And that's why the universe is saying, um, be careful, proceed with caution. You have to protect yourself and you have to start thinking more about yourself right now, Aquarius. I feel like it's very hard for you to do that. But this is the challenge for you. 
this is how you are going to grow. Growing is very uncomfortable, very uncomfortable, but it's so rewarding, okay? All right, Aquarius, that's all that I have for you. I hope this helped. Have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this and stay positive.